This feature is brought to you by the leader in short-term insurance, providing tailor-made solutions for most of South Africa's top 100 companies. Suntum, rest insured. David Shapiro sitting next to Izzy Bacher. Izzy's back by popular demand. I'm getting emails from people to say, what does Boots and All have to say about the gold price? But we'll hear from Izzy later. He came in on a good day, though. Gold up $20 today. Gold up $20. The gold index up about 6%. So... Uh, gold fields up 10% today. I think over last week it had three gains of 9%, you know, three uh, individual gains of 9%, 10% today. So gold fields just storming here. That seems to be the, the choice uh, amongst investors. Mm. Very interesting our, mm. our stock market today mm. because up until half past three, we were mm. looking pretty mm. bad. Mm. And then a late rally took it up two and a, 250, in fact, 250 yeah. points in the last hour or so, so that we ended in positive territory. Mm. And that rally is seriously continuing in America. Yeah, and for no reason. Can't find any specific reason. I'm sure that journalists and commentators will come up with it. But I think it's driven by a view that the worst's over. And also, quite a few commentators... No, I'm saying a view. I didn't say I'm my view. I said a view. And uh, Last night we say dead cat bounce. Today yeah. you say the worst's over. No, no, I'm saying that's a view. Izzy needs to jump in. Izzy, <laughs> yeah, no, I say why it's going in. Of yeah, course you can. Up. The cycle, it's a works on cycles. Are. The they cycle are. bottomed out <laughs> two days ago. Mm. But Izzy, when you were here in November, mm. October, you said that the Dow would hold 7,500. I was wrong, but it bounced. <laughs> I said the cycles were bound. I said the cycles, and it went from 7,500 to 9. Wasn't right. wrong, all right. Okay. Well, okay. well, we'll hear about Izzy from Izzy a little later <laughs> with gold. You have to restrain yourself, Izzy. You'll have your... <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about gold. I want to talk about the Dow. I think I'm very excited about the Dow. Okay. Uh, well, well uh, as long as the Dow goes up, everything else is going to go up. Because our market went up at a time. Uh, you're going to talk about manufacturing. And you're mm-hmm. going to talk about the contraction in mining. So uh, we ignored data, economic data, and just uh, went, uh, you know, went up across the board. So Even uh, Supergroup, really David. Even, even Supergroup super group went up. Covering off the today. very low yeah. base, yeah. What about mm. that uh, portfolio that we were talking about off air last night of the of the dead dug yeah. ducks, the, looking the dogs? So you put Anglo, you, <laughs> sorry, not Anglo. No, we've got to put Anglo in it. Sure, mm. it's no, a it's non-dividend not, payer. No, sure. but Anglo is not being uh, is not being priced for destruction. Yeah. Old Mutual is. Old Mutual is. Uh, Faritech. Yeah. Uh, Amaps we had earlier. Cl- clearly, Supergroup. Supergroup, sure. John Bickard on the um, market commentator blog to, uh, uh, podcast today. Uh, added Sappy to that list. Yes, as Sappy's well. a good one. Got any more to put in there? I don't know. We'll think about mm. them. I'm trying to. Well, as as we'll talk more, and you know, more will come up. Mm. But, but a big uh, day for a lot of shares, mm, uh, yeah. as you mentioned. Yeah, it uranium was. one up seventeen percent. Sure. And I, I think it's just driven by a change in sentiment. I was saying, you know, Buffett came on, and I, I was watching an interview with him today, and I'm on, paraphrasing on, uh, Bloomberg on Bloomberg's, TV. and just mm-hmm. paraphrasing what he's saying, you know, is that one's probably got to be fearful of inflation. You know, all the stimulus packages are going to bring inflation back, which is a good thing. And against that, in an inflationary world, you which can't… Which is a good thing? Well, at bring this back time. Inflation? At this time, yeah. We I need a bit of inflation. It's much better than deflation. So I think against that background, he says you can't hold cash. Certainly, it gives you a bit of comfort in the short term. So I think you're getting quite a few views that are starting to hold now. Now, I'm, listen, I'm thrilled with it. You know, we're all thrilled as long as the market keeps going up because it just, you know, it begins to give you a bit of positive sentiment in the market. And, of course, that's also good for economic growth.